Hey Frugivore, I'm Freely, welcome back to the Frugivore channel. So today's video is a response to Brittany Lancaster. Well, more of a check-in on Brittany Lancaster. Some of you may remember me doing a video on her TikToks, her What I Eat In A Day TikToks, um, you know, months ago. And one of the videos I believe had something like 20,000 dislikes because she sent her little team from TikTok, which is great because it exposed them to, you know, an actual healthy message. So that's going to be today's video. We're going to check it out. I had a look at her page and it, it doesn't look like she's improved at all. But anyway, we'll get to it in a moment. Um, also a comment here from Eva, the vegan teen. Hey Eva, thanks for your message on, on my um, last video. She said she hasn't um, been getting notified of premieres even after turning on the reminder, anyone else. And this is just, a, you know, a theme on my channel. Things aren't being, you know, my videos aren't being advertised. They're not being like promoted and also people are being unsubbed and not getting premiere like notifications. So what you got to do is just come here every day and check for a new video because that's what I'm doing. I'm uploading every single day. Okay, it's the only way we can get through this. All right, let's help Brittany. It's time. Let's go. Okay, Frugivore, so we're on Brittany Lancaster's TikTok page and she's got nearly a million, one million followers at this point. So she's reaching a lot of young women with the message that she's putting out. And we know from before what that message is. She wants to help other women recover from their ED. Let's pick a random one here. Good morning, TikTok. If I'm on your For You page for the first time today, hello, my name's Britt. I post what eating a days almost every single day of me being in recovery from two eating disorders in hopes to help others. Okay, so she so she says that she, she wants to help others. Okay, but for me, this just looks like she is eating junk food. She's calorie restricting junk food and she wants to justify it and say, hey, I'm recovering. I'm in recovery, so I can eat whatever I want. Okay, and, and that's not how it works, okay? You are not going to recover if you eat like this. She will be on this junk food calorie restriction cycle until the end. Like the previous video I made of the woman who's over 400 pounds who's eating rubbish and calorie restricting. It, it's just a sad truth, okay? And there's a lot of this going around. You cannot eat like this. This human engineered junk, absolute junk, is not going to help he heal you and also having drugs for breakfast recover as well this morning i'm trying this local donut shop in my town local i like how she says local it just makes makes me laugh because it's kind of like saying like it's a benefit to eat local maybe i think she's saying that but anyway it's a donut it's and so i got a donut from there and then also my iced lavender cold brew cheers okay so that's that's a terrible start to the day that's really bad. And you can see her skin is breaking out. She's gaining the weight back. And this is not to be unkind to Brittany or anything like that. This is just about speaking the truth. Okay. And this is what it helps individuals. You know, if you, you're just going to like pat them on the back and say, there, they're doing well when they're not doing well, then that's not going to help them. That's not going to help them get out of this. Yum. For lunch, oh. I'm having leftovers from my wow. chicken. Okay, so that is one of the greasiest things I've seen for a long, long time. Brit, what? <sighs> See, this I'm in recovery kind of statement is just allowing people to stay mediocre and to like make bad choices for their health and say, oh, well, I'm in recovery, so I can just, I can just eat whatever I want. No, no. If you actually want to heal and recovery, Foods like this are not included. Okay, this is not even a food. This should not go into your mouth. This is a dead bird covered in some sort of crumbed and oil and bovine secretion, which is meant for a baby cow. It's meant to grow a baby cow rapidly in the first six months of their life. So if we have this, if we have this bovine secretion as an adult, uh, you know, it, uh, it's going to make us grow rapidly and we don't want to grow rapidly, right? We're not meant to be having the secretion from another animal full stop. But anyway, this is just greasy. She can have pasta. Okay, have pasta, but just don't drown it in butter and oil. Oil is just refined fat. Doesn't have any minerals, doesn't have any carbohydrates, doesn't have any fiber. It is devoid of nutrition. It is just fat. Okay, it's a big old lie that to eating liquid fat is good for you. Farm that I had last night, I went to this incredible Italian restaurant in Portland called Just Pasta. Yeah, yeah, Italian dress restaurants are notorious for the oil. So much cheese and so much oil. It looks very much like from a restaurant. 
Brittany, it is time to get on Raw Till 4. Remember, I came from ED. I came from having an ED. And for many, many years, okay, I had binge problems. I'm not going to talk about it all on here because it'll probably get suppressed by the algorithm. But a lot of you know that I came from eating issues myself. And it's been over 14 years that I've recovered. So, Brittany, if you want to be fit, healthy, lean, you know, not have any more weight issues for the rest of your life, not have any more binge issues for the rest of your life, this is a lifestyle, okay? This is, this is the one. You can't just eat junk and restrict it and think, oh, I am going to be healthy. You know, I am eventually going to get into a healthy mindset. That's just not true, okay? It's not going to work. And it's also not kind to animals. So check it out. The link is in the description below. The Raw to 4 lifestyle. It will bring you the best results as it has for me after 14 years. 10 out of 10 would recommend, but now I'm having my leftovers. Now I'm having an oh. orange. What, there's an orange? Woo, there's an orange. Yes, Brent, you've got an orange. Some vitamin C. Yes, sister, but one. One orange is not enough for you. It's You are a frugivore. Get 10 in you, okay? Go and have 10 oranges. And p some people might be like, whoa, that's too many oranges. It's like, do you know how many calories are in an orange? I don't know, something like maybe 50 calories. It's only like 500 calories or so. You know, she's going to get more calories. That, that palm, chicken palm thing, it would have had a bunch more calories than having 10 oranges, which are full of nutrition, low in fat, high in fiber, high in carbohydrates, perfect for the human fruit ball. And the next thing here is... And then some of these harvest cheddar sunshine. A harvest cheddar... Okay, she, she, you can see she's really addicted to cheese. She's really addicted to that secretion that comes from a bovine's teats. That's what it is. And it's meant for the baby cow, as we said. And that's why her skin is breaking out. And that's why she's, she's gaining weight again. Okay, because this is one of the worst things that you can eat for acne, for your skin, is dairy. And I, I, I'm so surprised that she's still having it. I'm, I'm so surprised. And this is a highly processed thing. Express snack. For dinner, I got mod pizza. I love mod. Okay so much and i'm also having a strawberry lemonade okay so she's having a strawberry lemonade which is likely doesn't have any sugar it's probably like zero calorie you know uh the artificial sweetener ones because she's a fruit ball she needs some sweet so she's going for that and the pizza all right look again you can eat pizza if it's plant-based okay you know i'm all about the fruit i'm all about trying to get you to be a frugivore but I also get it that some people aren't at that point. And if you want to do the in recovery mode in a cooked plant-based way, then that is great too. Okay. And you can have pizza. Just leave off that, the liquid bovine secretion, like leave, leave off that. You know, you don't need to have that and load up the vegetables. You can eat way more because you get to eat more bites for your calories because of the fiber because it's high in fiber, plant foods are high in fiber. But when you eat these uh, concentrated animal bits and pieces, they don't have fiber, okay? And they have, they're very dense, so you can't eat as much for the amount of calories. So get the fiber in, that's, that's obviously not a great dinner. Finally for dessert, I'm having a chocolate ice cream sandwich. Can I all right, so she's still got the whole balance is key label up there. But this, this is not balance. This is just junk food. This is fake fruit. Okay, she's, she's building her body on cookies, animal secretion, dead bird, oil, butter. That's what she's building her body on, her cells on. Okay, you are what you eat, literally. It's an old saying, but it is true. Do you want to be built on cookies and animal secretion? I don't think so. So she's going for the sweet at the end of the day because she's not getting enough real nutrition to her cells, not enough glucose, fructose. And I'll say it again and again. I'll be repetitive in these videos because you need to get it. You need to really, really uh, like just understand. I say understand or understand, understand now, understand what I'm saying inside you. You need to really get this. So I'm going to be repetitive. This is not a great day. Okay. Okay, I just noticed this one. Look, look at my skin. It's glowing. 
Oh my goodness, look at my skin. We are glowing, we are glowing, and I owe so much thanks to oh Pacifica. So as you all know, I have been on a skin journey with Pacifica to try and treat my acne. Here's how I've been doing it. Okay, so she thinks that, she thinks that her acne is going to be cured by some random product. It doesn't work that way, okay? You gotta take out the cause of the problem, Brit. The cause of oh the problem goodness. is dairy, okay? The dairy is causing your acne issues. It's very well known. It's not a secret that dairy is like number one for acne. So please, get on the program, sis. Good morning, it's a one eating a day in recovery from two eating disorders for breakfast this morning. I'm having some honey bunches of oat cereal with milk, a banana, and then of course my iced coffee with milk. Okay, so her iced coffee with milk, she, that's a huge iced coffee. And it's also got cream, I, I believe on the top, but she had a banana there. That's great. It was a yellow banana. It was unripe, but it was a banana. And you know I'm happy because I'm the banana girl. <laughs> so Brit, just please wait for it to be ripe and spotty or it can cause your digestive issues because it's just not ready. And that's nature saying, hey, I'm not ready. Don't eat me yet. Wait till I'm ripe. Wait till the, the sugars are fully developed. So this, yeah, coffee obviously is the, the largest item of her breakfast is a coffee and it's full of cream. Uh, where's the, f you know, more fresh, more fresh. And creamer and whipped cream. Cheers. Whipped cream. All right, now for lunch, I'm having a fresh turkey sandwich. I, sis, there's not much fresh about that, okay? The bread, all right. It might be plant-based, but that bread is not fresh. That bread is probably from wheat that is maybe five years old or, so, or like uh, flour that is <laughs> five years old. You, you don't know, okay? It can sit there for a long, long time. So that's not fresh. It is, there is a strip of fresh there. I can see some tomato and lettuce. That's great, but too smaller amount. And it's got obviously flesh. And again, is that cheese? From um, Whole Foods with a bunch of veggies and then some cheddar cheese on top. Cheddar, she, she's obsessed with cheddar. Brittany, it's not working for you. It is not working for you. And the flesh, obviously that's not working for the animal. They're on the bottom. <laughs> now for dinner, I'm having some oh, green grapes. That was it. Okay, that's not a lot of food. Some green grapes. Oh, there's some fresh. Look at that tiny serve. She's she's very scared of the fruit. It's a mixed green salad with some, Whoa. some cucumbers on top and a top. There's not much going on there. There's not much. Go I mean, the amount of calories that she's having from fresh throughout her whole day is like a single banana, a little bit of tomato, a little bit of green. It's probably all up about 200 calories. And the rest is coming from non-foods. Italian dressing and then some black peppered pasta. With That's a tiny serve too, but you know, you can see again, it's got butter or oil on it and probably cheese as well. With butter on top. Oh, butter on top. Okay, butter on top. So you, Bria, you can have a massive amount of pasta. Just don't put the butter on top. Don't put anything like animal related or even oil. Don't put it on there. Just put vegetables on. And then you can just go to town, eat it, eat it, eat it. And you are going to actually like get healthier and slimmer by doing that because carbs don't make you fat. Okay. Pasta does not make you fat on its own. Finally, for dessert, I'm having some Ben and Jerry's ice cream. Of course. Of course you are because you are a frugivore starving for sugar, for glucose, for fructose. And this is just, again, fake fruit. That's what it is. This is a frugivore heading for fake fruit. And obviously it's full of fat as well. This is like durian. All right. This is a replacement for durian. We're meant to be eating durian. She's having this ice cream. <sighs> okay. So an, more more dairy for her her acne and her weight gain she's going to gain gain it all back and she's going to continu continue having skin issues so you can see the problem here okay she's having food that is meant for a baby cow the secretions are meant for a baby cow and she's also eating the flesh of animals she's also eating a lot of processed foods a lot of fat this is not going to help her recover okay if you truly want to heal you need to eat healing foods Foods that actually heal your body, not just any old crap that humans create in a lab. You know, that that's not healing food. All right. That's my video for today. Let Brittany know I made this video. We need to get her on Raw Till 4. Brittany, get on Raw Till 4. Sister, you can just go to town. You can feel so great. You can eat as much as you care for. You can be healed in no time like I am myself for 14 years.